And now, to possibly finish this. Definitely at least do Secret Date. Yusuf, are you up here? Please say we're up here. <laughs> He's not up here. God damn it. Hmm. Yeah, he didn't. Back pain. <laughs> that was bad. That was a terrible joke. I feel I should probably fast travel more. I never really think to. Which is probably a bit silly, really. I don't need it. I don't want it. But it's there. <laughs> nope, good. Did not know that was there. Makes things easier. You what? Just where actually is he? And I mean, I'm assuming it's used to like, Oh, that was it. It's because it's, it's, it's they've got Sophia, isn't it? Damn, she's been kidnapped for a while. She's probably dead. <laughs> Just like, she's been dead for two weeks. What were you doing? Hello? Are you dead? But he was one of the good ones. Brothers, sisters, the whole city rises against us, while Yusuf's murderer waits and watches from the arsenal, laughing. Fight with me, and show him what it means to cross the assassins. Because vengeance. Going full out war. Go with that. I, I know that nothing dead. Assassins, if you would. <laughs> oh, I get to use it just fucking constantly. That's amazing. Now! Die! Assassin! It's always one that tries to live, but none will. Just give up. I'm not even paying attention to the fact I'm dying. 
Here, bring it, bitch. Where is she? Where is she? <laughs> Such fury. Where is she? If you think you are in a position to negotiate, kill me and be done with it. I am sorry it had to come to this. Two men who should be friends, quarreling over the keys to a library. We both strive for the same end, Ezio. Only our methods differ. Do you not see that? Peace, stability, a world where men live without fear. People desire the truth, yes. But even when they have it, they refuse to look. How do we fight this kind of ignorance? Liberty can be messy, Ahmed. But it is priceless. Of course. And when things fall apart, and the lights of civilization dim, Ezio Auditore can stand above the darkness and say proudly, I stayed true to my creed. The children I will is not open that about library, it. and I will find the Grand Temple. And with the power that is hidden there, I will destroy the superstitions that keep men divided. Not in this life, Ahmed. Bring the seals to Galata Tower when you are ready. Do this, and Sophia will be spared. My brother's army will be here soon, Ezio. After that, everything changes. You know you can die, right? How long have you been here? Long enough? I had Ahmed Ted as soon as he returned. But I never expected to hear all this. And what do you think? He is a sincere man. But this Templar fantasy of his is dangerous. It flies in the face of reality. The world is a tapestry of many colors and patterns. A just leader would celebrate this, not seek to unravel it. He fears the disorder that comes from difference. That is why we make laws to live by. A kanun that applies to all in equal measure. Shastadem! Stand back! Hold, soldier! This man is not our enemy. What a challenge it would be to have a son like you. You are not dead yet, old friend. Ezio, spare my uncle if you can. Would your father? No. I'll see what I can do, but I probably won't. I say probably. <laughs> Damn. There's a lot of dead people. There's a long way to go. So I shall be fast travelling. The first opportunity. Which will present itself right? There. Jesus. They're all dead. Killed all of your army. Well, a lot of your army. We're now fucked. Don't let him escape! Jesus Christ. Bitch. There we go. I hate those guys so much. Uh, me, you just you literally just saw me kill them all. Okay. Oh, it is literally right in here.
He still has the last one, right? Or were there only five? Or were there six? But I only got five because he has the last one. Like I'm gonna need them. Take out all of his guards. On my own. I can and will. Should probably go to a blacksmith to get my armor fixed first though. So I shall. Can I get anything more powerful? Yeah, it's actually a sword. Oh, yeah, no. Come again, please. Good as it's gonna get. Also, I, I seem to remember Yusuf's death being more dramatic than that. <coughs> How you doing? Mentor? Now should be a time for remembrance and mourning, I know. But our enemies do not permit us that luxury. Yusuf thought highly of you. Assassin, and I find no reason to second-guess this judgment. Do you have it in your heart to lead these men and women and to maintain the dignity of our order as Yusuf did with such passion? It would be an honor. Bene, I am glad. Our enemy is close. Take positions around the tower and wait for my command. Why well, you were wearing the wrong color? Why well, you like this? How you doing? Where is she? I admire you, Ezio. But your bloodlust makes it hard to call you a friend. Bloodlust? A strange insult from the man who ordered an attack on his own nephew. You he got point. kidnapped, Ezio. Not killed. I see. Kidnapped by the Byzantines so that his uncle could rescue him and be heralded the hero. More or less. Well, now, that didn't happen. The keys. Not all this. First, the girl. <laughs> She's all yours. Sophia! Tell your men to back off. She's all yours. Take them. I'll get them back. And I will kill you. Well, fuck. I don't know how. I'm assuming one of my assassins killed the guy. I mean, I'm glad they did. Thank you. <laughs> it's there. 
How you doing? I'm gonna, I'm gonna let it go. It's not even her. This is bullshit. Oh god. That's the one. Uh, neither. Sphere. If I can live. That was fucked up. That was fucked up. Are you hurt? Not, not hurt, but very confused. That's fair. I did not mean to drag you into this. I am sorry. And you are not responsible for the actions of other men. All this will be over soon, honest. but I need to recover what they have taken. I do not understand what is happening, Ezio. Who are these men? Run! <laughs> oh yay, more carriage sections. Sass me, woman. If we were in no, it's, it's no time for sass. Oh no! Why you do this? Why you do this, Sophia? How, how can you don't climb back up? Oh Jesus Christ! Va bene, I am all right. Good. Soldiers, up ahead. I see them. Fucking Batman. Apparently. <laughs> oh, that's fantastic. And a double kill. Nope. Oh, fuck. Nope. Oh, ow. That was a mountain. Forgive me! Learn to drive for the- Must be careful! I know, I know! Learn to drive. Steal yourself, Sophia! More soldiers! That's one. Oh fuck, I'm going to the fucking face. Back up. Back up of what is essentially my girlfriend at this point. Future wife. That's what I said. Get, off, get away from my future wife. Fast 
Okay, you've been fed. None for you. Out in the road. Got him. Sucks for you. And I can't. Ow! Kill myself. And I'm gonna die. Because I have no fucking medicine. Oh god. Let me survive this, let me survive this! Ouch, that hurt. Oh it's fear! Please move. I'm so fucking dead. I'm so fucking dead! Oh god. Oh god. Oh, I don't like this. Not so Could you not double kill? Fucking trying to shoot her. That includes you, the bitch. I think we're good. Still gonna fucking die. Presumably you taught them. Or your guards did. Jesus. <laughs> ah, I see. Pressing the wrong fucking button. <laughs> I was pressing the right button instead of trigger. That was that was fucking stupid. I mean, I don't I, I don't know what he's trying to achieve. He's gonna he's gonna die anyway. Parachutes! Shit. Could not just drop him. Oh, no. I would have just dropped him. It's been like none for you. <laughs> so what now, it's you? How does this end? You die, you I die, am you wondering die. that myself. Oh! Soldiers! Selim is not your master! 
You serve the Sultan! You carry out his command alone! Where is he? Where is the Sultan? Right in front of me. He stands before you, brother. Father made his choice. Villain! Stop! Please! He's also better dressed. I mean, fucking look at him, it looks awesome. So, you are the assassin. Ezio Auditore. Yep. I am Selim, Suleiman's father. He speaks quite highly of you. He is a remarkable you. boy with a magnificent mind. Were it not for his endorsement, I would have you killed where you stand. Leave this place. Do not return. Come on, man, don't be like that. <laughs> you did the right thing, Ezio. This is not your fight. But where does one end and the next begin? I'd also like to see you fucking try killing me where I stand. Good luck with that. Better men than you have tried. waiting to talk to everyone. I hope you have something for us. Absolutely. Passports and papers for everyone. Ah, brilliant. So I'm... I'm what? A neurosurgeon now, am I? You're a medical team from SUNY Upstate. Just back from Rome with your patient. Experimental gene therapy. <laughs> Good work. Let's get this over with. Wait, look. This is crazy. What's wrong? I'm not sure, but Desmond's brain is lighting up like a string of firecrackers. Is he gonna wake up? I mean, I assume he's got it at some point. How are you doing, Clyde? Here it comes. What is that? What's going on? This is the end, Desmond. Scheduled for deletion! What are you doing? What is a man but the sum of his memories? We are the stories we live! The tales we tell ourselves! Don't do this! I'm saving you, idiot! Go! Go! Oh, I liked him despite he's a little bit crazy. these lines with a steady hand and a light heart. We are in Acre now, Sophia and I, with the five Masyaf keys in our possession and all the time in the world. Sophia is a seasoned traveler and a fine companion to have so far from home. I bet she is. Tomorrow we will make our way to Masyaf and once there, into Altair's library to fulfill our father's forgotten dream. Forgive the shortness of this letter, dear sister. For it is late, and we are tired. Mm -hmm. Perhaps, with luck, the next words you hear from me will be in person. Con affetto, Ezio. This is where your order began? It began thousands of years ago, but here it was reborn. By the man you mentioned, Altair? Altair ibn Lahad. He built us up, 
and set us free. He saw he the folly of keeping outrageous. a castle like this. It had become a symbol of arrogance and a beacon for all our enemies. And the mandate for menacing hoods? Was that his idea as well? <laughs> <laughs> you mentioned a creed before. What is it? Nothing is true. Everything is permitted. That is rather cynical. It would be if it were doctrine. But it is merely an observation of the nature of reality. To say that nothing is true is to realize that the foundations of society are fragile and that we must be the shepherds of our own civilization. To say that everything is permitted is to understand that we are the architects of our actions and that we must live with their consequences, whether glorious or tragic. And it's good creed. Do you regret your decision to leave as an assassin for so long? Nah. I do not remember making that decision. This life, it chose me. For three decades, I have served the memory of my father and my brothers, and fought for those who have suffered the pain of injustice. So from the time you were 20, regret those like years, 20, 30, 40, but it is time 30, 40, to live for myself. So yeah, you're probably in your 50s by now. Go. Let go of all of this. Then let go. The end of the road. What do you hope to find behind that door? Knowledge, above all else. Altair was a profound man, and a prolific <laughs> writer. He built this place as a repository for all his wisdom. He saw many things in his life, and learned many secrets, both troubling and strange. Knowledge that would drive lesser men to despair. Does that worry you? Nah, I'm good. Sophia, you should know by now that I am not a lesser man. It's you. Hold on a second. I just got that joke. Gross fuck. You had better come out of there alive. Uh, I, I probably will. I mean, I've gone through two of these temples before and lived. Three of them, actually. Thinking about Pythagorean one. See no reason I won't this time. Is this really necessary, Ezio? It's not that, it's not that dark. Can't even run or anything. It's a nice library though. I mean, if there was still stuff in it. No books. No wisdom. <laughs> Just I'll tell you it's dead, don't you, fratello mio. Moths have got out. You have seen to my books. Yes. Some we sent with the polos. The rest will go with me to Alexandria. Good. Very good. Father, I do not understand. Why did you build a library if you did not intend to keep your books? You should go. When the Mongols return, Masyaf must be empty. I see. This is not a library at all. 
It is a vault. It must stay hidden, Darim. Far from eager hands. At least until it has passed on the secret it contains. What secret? Go, son. Go be with your family. And live well. All that is good in me began with you, father. It's a really cool robes. I'll give him that. I mean, they're, they're awesome. In much wisdom is much grief. And See, he, he, know he, knowledge, he knows he's about to die. Sorrow. But it's still like... What does it tell you? What if we're not actually what living for like see? two weeks? And you're just like, shit, I have no food. Strange Fuck. messages of ones who came before, of their rise and their fall. So it looks like a robe, it's so cool. Here. To our family, what does the apple say? Who were the ones I think all the worms are cooler though, just because it's a color scheme. But this is more assassin. How long ago? Get rid of that thing! Can I? This is my duty, Maria. Ah. <laughs> so this is going. <laughs> Was I gonna, gonna just sit down in the chair? I'm Where old. You? I need a rest. If you are asked, say I sent the apple away. Tell them I sent it to Cyprus or Sipango or that I dropped it into the sea. Tell them anything to keep men away from this place. This apple must not be found. Not until the time is right. It's not exactly a conspicuous doorway, I'll tell you. That does not look comfy. You're not going to be needing these robes anymore. <laughs> Damn, that's a lot of money. Another artifact. No. You will stay here. I have seen enough for one life. I don't think I can do that. My curious to get about me. I'm just like, nope, mine. He's talking to me. I heard your name once before, Desmond. A long time ago. And now it lingers in my mind, like an image from an old dream. I do not know where you are, or by what means you can hear me. But I know you are listening. I have lived my life as best I could, not knowing its purpose, but drawn forward like a moth to a distant moon. And here at last, I discover a strange truth. And I am only a conduit for a message that eludes my understanding. Who are we, who have been so blessed, to share our stories like this? 
speak across centuries. Maybe you will answer all the questions I have asked. Maybe you will be the one to make all this suffering worth something in the end. Now, listen. Wake the fuck up. Do you hear me, Cypher? Can you see me? Yes. Ah, there you are. Good. A strange place, this nexus of time. I am not used to the calculations. That has always been Minerva's domain. I see you still have many questions. Who were we? What became of us? What do we desire of you? You will have your answers. Only listen, and I will tell you how. Both before the end and after, we sought to save the world. We built vaults within which to work, each dedicated to a different method of salvation. They were placed underground to avoid the war which raged above, and also as a precaution should we fail in our efforts. Each vault's knowledge was transmitted to a single place. It was our duty, mine, Minerva's, and Juno's, to sort and sample all that was collected. We chose those solutions which held the most promise and devoted ourselves to testing their merits. Six we tried in succession, each more encouraging than the last, but none worked. And then the world ended. The earth shook for days, the fires burned for weeks, and when the ash had settled, less than 10,000 of your kind still lived, and far fewer of ours. But we carried on, together, to rebuild, to renew. Listen, you must go there, to the place where we labored, labored and lost. Take my words. Pass them from your head into your hands. That is how you will open the way. But be warned, 
Much still remains in flux, and I do not know how things will end, either in my time or yours. Wait, look, his vitals are stabilizing. Something's happening. He's... he's moving. Desmond, can you hear me? Son? I know what we need to do. 